Hey guys, you're driving with Joe, and today is Tune In Tuesday. From the 2020 Nissan Qashqai, this one's actually the SL, so it's not the top model, the SL with the Platinum package, it's just the SL, very nice, you're still getting your leather and all that fancy stuff. As you could just see in the video, the exterior is changed tremendously. You got those new super sharp wheels, the front grille has a couple inserts, the rear has some changes, big change on the taillights there, those uh, more European looking taillights, they look super sharp. The standard safety features, which you'll find I also mentioned in my previous video in part one, uh, the standard safety features are tremendous for the 2020 cash guide. Let's talk about those. For safety features, I just wanna start with the automatic emergency braking and the predictive forward collision warning. You're gonna have the sensor in the front and it will essentially stop the vehicle or lessen the severity of an impact if a collision is unavoidable using that front sensor. You do have the forward predictive collision warning. So Nissan uses actually uh, the sensor that measures two vehicles in front of you instead of just one. And it can warn you if a potential collision is uh, about to happen as well as a rear intelligent emergency braking that they just added standard to every single trim level. So if I was to put this vehicle in reverse right now, you would have seen on the Murano video I did a little while back that actually the vehicle will stop by itself without hitting say the wall behind me or a person or something like that if the sensors can pick that up. So very cool that that is standard on every single Qashqai, even the very basic entry level one. Next, you're gonna have your standard blind spot warning. So basically what the blind spot warning does is it will warn you if somebody is in the lane next to you so that you don't change lanes into someone. What I'm gonna do is I'll turn on the vehicle just to show you what the blind spot warning looks like. It's gonna be on the inside of the vehicle. Right there, you see the orange light on the pillar. So that will illuminate if you're driving, say, down the highway and someone's in your blind spot. If you then put your signal on, the light will start to flash and you'll hear an audible beep just to ensure that you don't change lanes into that person right beside you. With the standard blind spot warning, you're also getting a standard rear cross traffic alert. So say you're parked at the shopping center. It's coming up to Christmas, actually. You're parked in between two huge trucks and visibility is limited for when you're backing out. While you're backing out with the standard backup camera, you can use that. If you're parking between those huge trucks, the vehicle will actually use a sensor to read the lane in behind you. So if someone is driving in the lane behind you, whatever side they're driving from, the left or the right, the blind spot warning lights, those orange lights that you just saw, will actually blink to let you know what side a vehicle will be driving from so that you can be cautious when you're backing out and then ensure that you get out there safely without actually running into someone because nowadays all those shopping centers are completely congested and it's pretty tough to navigate around there. So definitely a big help with that rear cross traffic alert. Now, another cool thing that is standard in every single cash guy, I'm just gonna use my driver's assistance display Basically to control that, it's gonna be on the pad right here. So I'm gonna use that and go to my settings, driver's assistance. So in your driving aids, you have steering assist, emergency brake from the front and the rear, like we just talked about. Your lane departure warning is what I wanted to mention. So it has standard lane departure warning and lane departure prevention. I'll turn that one on there. Lane departure warning will actually warn you with a couple beeps when you cross over a dotted line or a solid line on the road. Basically, warn you and gently guide you back in with the prevention. So how it does that is breaking the opposite side of the vehicle. So if you start drifting, say driving down the road and you start drifting to the left, the vehicle or your cash guy will break the right side to gently bring you back and keep you centered in between the lines so that you don't drift too far across the road. Let's recap that. You have standard automatic emergency braking from the front, which actually lowers your insurance at the moment with ICBC if you're in British Columbia. Very cool. You have the predictive forward collision warning. You have rear intelligent emergency braking. You have your blind spot warning and your rear cross traffic alert system. You have the lane departure warning and prevention as well. And then standard on every single cash guy is going to be those 10 airbags. Very cool that they've stepped up the safety game for the 2020 Nissan Qashqai. 
like I mentioned in the last video, majority of the competitors are only gonna have six airbags in their vehicles. So we do have the 10 in the 2020 Qashqai. Now, although this is brand new for 2020, the exterior has drastically changed as well as the standard safety features. The interior is very similar. So you're gonna notice this display right up here is similar to the previous 2019 model as well as you see the steering wheel here you got your pro pilot assist button you'll see that in one of my videos i show you how that blue little button works there with your intelligent cruise control and then over here down at the bottom you got your heated steering wheel the all-wheel drive lock button over here you got sport and eco mode there's your steering assist button right up here and then your track control off button is here so everything looks very similar the upholstery looks similar as well but they did add a couple uh cool touches like you got this new little trim piece there looks pretty sharp you can see it carries on over to the side over here and then of course you got your soft touch up here but big on the safety it's it's amazing guys right, so thanks for stopping by the driving with joe youtube channel and checking out this episode of tune in tuesday the cash guy i was in actually just sold while i was finishing up part of this review so somebody saw it came in and actually ended up buying it so that is the end of this review which is very cool actually a lot of hype around this new cash guy the 2020 which has all the standard stuff but anyway thanks for stopping by if you liked the video be sure to hit that thumbs up if you didn't like the video and this was not helpful at all hit the thumbs down and leave a comment and tell me why i always love the feedback from you guys of course subscribe to the youtube channel and support it so that i can keep making these videos we'll see you guys next week for another episode of tune in tuesday